Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Eku, and in this video, I'm going to show you how I transform my patio from meh to yas vibes. <laughs> so make sure you watch till the end of the video because I'm going to share some photos that you don't want to miss. Hit the like button, subscribe, and let's get started. So I'm trying to come up with ways to spruce up my patio, you know, make it more fun and inviting. And we did the grass wall, you guys saw the grass wall video. After that, I got this string light installed. I was gonna do it by myself, but then I realized how tasking it was gonna be and it involved heavy work that I can't do. So I hired somebody to put them up for me. I didn't want the lights to lay on here. Cause I, I don't know, I just felt like that was kind of boring. You know how you have it at the restaurants, right? Like that's kind of how I wanted it, diagonal. All my outdoor furniture is here. I'm gonna set it up and also show you a few hacks on how I'm gonna make it smart. I use these little table plugs to pin it to the wall that way it's not, the table is not hanging around. And these you can get from Home Depot. I'll link it in the description box. So now for the fun part. I got this chair set from Wayfair. I love the beach look, especially on a patio. And these chairs fit exactly what I was going for. I also got a rug and listen, don't let anyone ever tell you that you don't need an outdoor rug because you do. I mean, other than the fact that you avoid splinters, it ties in the whole look together. Um, this one that I got actually even matches the pillows. And everything just comes together with the rug. It just ties everything in just like it should be. I mean, I'm already getting vibes just looking at the ensemble right now. I feel like I should just go light up my hookah or something. The rug I got from Overstock. And the same thing with the egg chair, I got it from overstock.com as well. It's perfect for outdoor reading, relaxation, a glass of wine, you know, just the perfect vibes. And guys, at night, the whole look just looks serene out here. I mean, with the string lights and everything, it's just amazing, calming and soothing. And to be fair, it's one of the best purchases that I've made. I hooked up the basket of the chair from the top, and then I realized it didn't have enough torque at the bottom so it wouldn't fit so I couldn't hook it up from the bottom so I had to take off everything which was a little frustrating because the seat is really heavy and because I was doing it solo I had to use my leg to prop up the seat while I hooked it up at the top so if you see me struggling here that's what's going on What do you guys think? Leave those there? I can't have it near my grass wall because it takes away. It's kind of a lot of furniture, actually. What do you think? And then on this side, we have these two. This, this. 